The proof of Peters Township's character is in the data. Located in southwestern Pennsylvania, the Peters Township School District serves more than 21,000 residents and current enrollment is 4,490 students. There are 515 dedicated faculty members, administrators, and support staff that serve our children. Our staff emphasizes character building as a process rather than a program as to engage the hearts of the students and encourage the implementation of character related strategies. Good character is taught, promoted, expected, and celebrated. Peters Township's foundation is built upon a community-based effort known as Character Counts to promote the core values of respect, responsibility, and honesty throughout the community. PTSD has been implementing character education intentionally since 1999. In 2010, the Peters Township School District was named the National School District of Character. The program was founded by Dr. Robert Freda. Character education is incorporated into the school system in a comprehensive manner. Over 10 years ago, we made a decision that the comprehensive approach would be best for our community and for our schools. So by a comprehensive approach, we mean that we want to infuse character into all aspects into the life of the school, whether it's through curricular experiences, or our interactions with students and the community through policy or through the handbook uh, issues, disciplinary matters, general procedures. We wanted to integrate character into the life of the school. Students at Pleasant Valley learn how to share, care, and be respectful. I think character is portrayed in my classroom by working together, teamwork, as we're doing right now. Um, we all respect each other. We use manners. We say thank you and please. Um, children raise their hands to answer questions. Um, my children are very loving and very compassionate. Uh, we had a, a custodian who had surgery and their first instinct was let's write him cards, let's make him cards and send them to him. Also we had a new student in the classroom and they did the same thing on their own. I didn't even start it or initiate it, they just said let's make him cards. And so when the new student arrived he had a desk full of cards on his desk that welcomed him. And when I met with his parents yesterday they said what a warm and welcoming feeling it meant to them to have those, his ch their child be welcomed so much into our classroom. Um, so we use character every day. We um, do different things where we work together, we work by ourselves sometimes, um, on the playground, when we're at lunch, we talk about how working together and respecting others and using our manners all play into being a good citizen and having leadership skills to, in order to help them in their, in their life, not just for the classroom setting but also out in the, the world. Bower Hill's motto is to work hard, learn a lot, and be busy as bees. We incorporate character education into my classroom on a daily basis. Whenever we have volunteers who come in to help, the boys and girls immediately stop anything they're doing and we clap because we appreciate how volunteers give up their time for us. We also recognize um, the accomplishments of the boys and girls in the class and we will notice when they have done something over and above what is expected. We will take a moment out of our time and we will immediately call their parent to let them know about the special thing that they've done. And the boys and girls love shouting, way to go into the phone. And that makes everybody happy. Another thing we do is the Hearts of Hope activity. And this is just when boys and girls find an extra coin or they do a little extra thing at home to earn a, a, some, a, a few cents. They might come in and they'll stand and share that they did a special chore to help boys and girls who don't have as much as we have in Peters Township. So we have a lot of fun doing some character education in our class. Bower Hill students sure have big hearts. McMurray Elementary School prides itself on teaching students good matters. Character is incorporated in the curriculum. Character means is like being nice to other people. Um, like if um, like if like you find something that's lost, you like try to like give it back to that person. Um, and like it's like paying attention when like other people are talking and not being rude. What do you think about compatible? And
it's good guess. I'm not just going to say blah, blah, blah. I'm going to have to use one. I'm thinking, gosh, I don't know how many times 8 goes into 55. So I can look at my 32. I got you with a big number. What would come next? 40. And 560. Character becomes meaningful at middle school. The Hearts of Gold project is a project that we're doing for Character Counts Month, um, promoting character throughout our building. It's implemented through the language arts um, classes where the students each receive a gold heart. As you can see up here, um, these are the hearts that they're all receiving. And they're asked to do a random act of kindness throughout um, this week as well as throughout the year. Write about it and then come to the front of the school and put their heart up on our Hearts of Gold poster. Um, I think character means like how people are good to people and how they care about others and like for example like when someone drops their pencil or falls down the stairs you help them pick it up. At the middle school students truly have hearts of gold. Character is exemplified through real life situations. At the high school, we strive to teach our students character in real life situations. We want what we're teaching in the classroom to extend beyond the classroom and to help them to make ethical decisions throughout their entire lives. Each month, students who demonstrate outstanding character are honored as Student Citizens of the Month. It's very nice that um, I was recognized as a Student Citizen of the Month. Um, not something that I was out to get specifically, but it's just nice whenever, you know, your actions don't go unnoticed and um, gives you more incentive to continue doing said actions and possibly drive other students to do so. A program we do here in the library where we integrate music, art, and library through literature that reflects one of those themes we started this year with having a plan and so uh, we piggybacked off of Stephen Covey's book and we used some children's literature like Security School where the kids learn to have a plan and to begin with the end in mind. All of those things help them when they're making decisions. We really try to teach them to make good choices. An effort to enhance the Character Counts program Peters Township has incorporated Stephen Covey's seven habits into the culture of the school district. As you can see, character truly does count in the Peters Township School District. The component is that it's a way of life here so that we personally set a standard individually for everyone. Not only is it visual, that you can see it above the cafeteria at the high school, at the, at the entrance to the middle school, in every one of our buildings, but you hear it and you see it in action in all of the buildings as well. When, we, when the district decided to pursue the National School District of Character Award, what I found interesting was that it is ingrained into everything we do. Um, that it is in so many ways throughout the district, not only with the students, with the staff, it's in the PTA, it's in the township, it's in sports. It's in ways that people don't even realize what they're doing anymore. Um, which is so wonderful that it's become a part of the fabric that is Peters Township. We have it written into all of the curricular areas as well. So students blog about the seven habits, they talk about random acts of kindness. At the elementary schools they're talking about filling up their buckets so that every area, every discipline, it's incorporated. Even here at the district administration offices we work hard at not only having it listed and visible to us on the walls, but also in treating each other with kindness every day. Our school board has adopted resolutions related to character counts. Our township has done the same. Um, it's very much all the way from the school board down to the kindergarten students. It's everybody district-wide. 